Let's read Mark 2 verse 22. And no one puts new wine into old wineskins, or else the new wine bursts the wineskins, the wine is spilled, and the wineskins are ruined. But new wine must be put into new wineskins. In the journey of life, each of us reaches points where we stand on the brink of something new, a new chapter, a fresh start, a different perspective. It's in these moments that the words of Jesus in Mark 2 verse 22 echo with profound significance. Just as new wine requires new wineskins, so too do our new beginnings necessitate new thinking. Every new beginning in our life is an opportunity to grow, to expand, and to experience more of what God has for us. Whether it's a new job, moving to a new city, starting a new relationship, or embarking on a spiritual journey, each new phase brings with it the promise of something fresh and exciting. However, stepping into a new beginning often requires a shift in our thinking. Our natural minds, accustomed to the familiar and the comfortable, can be quick to resist change. Doubts may arise, negative thoughts may bombard us, and fears may seek to hold us back. Thoughts like, it's not going to happen for you, you won't recover from this illness, or you'll always be alone, are attempts to keep you confined to old wineskins. These are the echoes of fear and doubt trying to prevent you from stepping into the new things God has for you. One powerful way to combat these doubts and embrace new thinking is through positive affirmations based on God's word. Declarations like, I am ready for increase. God is guiding me to a new level and my best days are ahead of me can reprogram our minds to align with God's promises. Trusting in God's plan for our lives is crucial for a new beginning. It means believing that he knows what's best for us and that his plans are to prosper us, not to harm us. This trust can transform our perspective, turning uncertainty into expectancy and apprehension into excitement. Just as new wine requires new wineskins, new beginnings often require us to let go of the past. Holding on to old grievances, past mistakes, or former failures can hinder us from fully embracing what God is doing now. It's like trying to pour new wine into old, brittle wineskins. This journey of renewal and new thinking is not always easy. It requires faith, patience, and often a conscious effort to change our thought pattern. But the rewards of this journey are immeasurable. A deeper understanding of God's love, a more profound experience of his blessings, and a life that truly reflects his glory. In this journey, the role of a supportive community, whether it be a church, a small group, or trusted friends, cannot be understated. Surrounding ourselves with people who encourage us, who speak life into our dreams, and who stand with us in faith can make all the difference. Nurturing the new things in our lives involves more than just wishful thinking. It requires action. It's about taking steps, however small, towards the realization of our new beginnings. It might be learning a new skill, improving our health, deepening our spiritual practices, or building new relationships. As we conclude, let us remember this. God is doing a new thing in your life. He is ready to pour out new wine, blessings, opportunities, experiences, but he asks you to provide the new wineskins, new thinking, new attitudes, and a new heart. Are you ready to make that change? Are you ready to embrace the new that God has for you? Remember, with God, all things are possible. Your new beginning is an opportunity to experience God's goodness in ways you've never imagined. Embrace this new chapter with faith. Let go of the past and step forward into the bright future God has prepared for you. Let us now come together in prayer. Heavenly Father, our Creator and God, 
We bow our heads in humility and lift our hearts in gratitude as we come before you. Today, as we ponder the profound concept of new beginnings and new thinking, we seek your guidance and your strength. Lord, we thank you for the seasons of newness and renewal that you bring into our lives. We are grateful for the opportunities to grow, to learn, and to experience more of the abundant life you have promised us. In these moments of new beginnings, help us to embrace the fresh perspectives and positive changes you are calling us to. We acknowledge, Father, that with new beginnings often come challenges and uncertainties. Our minds may be clouded with doubts, and our hearts may be gripped with fear. Thoughts of inadequacy or past failures may attempt to hold us back. In these times, we ask for your wisdom and your reassurance. Remind us that, with you, all things are possible, and that you are with us in every step of our journey. Lord, help us to overcome the barriers of old thinking. Teach us to let go of past grievances, to release our previous mistakes, and to step away from the old wineskins that can no longer contain the new blessings you are pouring into our lives. Instill in us a spirit of positive affirmation, grounded in your word, that we may confidently declare your truths over our lives. We pray for the courage to step into the new things you are doing in us and through us. Grant us the boldness to pursue new opportunities, to develop new skills, and to forge new relationships that honor your name and reflect your love. In this journey of new beginnings, surround us with a community of support and encouragement. May we find strength and inspiration from fellow believers, drawing from their faith and wisdom as we navigate the paths you have laid out for us. As we nurture the new things you are growing in us, let us not just be hearers of your word, but doers. Help us to take active steps towards realizing the dreams and visions you have placed in our hearts. May our actions reflect our faith, and may our lives be a testament to your endless grace and goodness. For everyone listening or watching, Lord, I pray for a special outpouring of your Spirit. Fill them with hope and expectancy for the new beginnings you are ushering into their lives. In moments of hesitation or doubt, bring them reassurance and peace, and remind them that they are never alone in their journey. As we conclude this prayer, we do so with hearts full of anticipation and mouths ready to testify of your faithfulness. We eagerly await the new chapters you are writing in our lives, confident in the knowledge that with each new beginning comes a deeper revelation of your love and a greater experience of your blessings. In the mighty and transformative name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. As we bring our time of reflection on new beginnings and new thinking to a close, I invite you to join us on this exciting journey of growth and transformation. If today's message has inspired you, if you feel a stirring in your heart to embrace the new things God is doing in your life, I encourage you to subscribe to our channel. By subscribing, you're not just keeping up with our content. You're becoming part of a community of believers who are committed to embracing change, pursuing growth, and walking in faith. Each video, each message we share, is a step towards understanding God's plan for our lives and responding to His call with positive action and renewed thinking. Subscribing means joining a family of faith where we encourage each other in our individual journeys, sharing insights, experiences, and encouragement. It's about being part of a space where new beginnings are celebrated, where transformation is embraced, and where each step forward is supported by a community of like-minded individuals. So, I warmly invite you to take this step to be part of our growing community by clicking the subscribe button. Let's journey together, supporting each other as we step into the new chapters God has for us and grow in the knowledge and love of Him. 
Thank you for being with us today. May you go forth with courage and joy, ready to embrace the new beginnings and new thinking that await you. Remember, in every new chapter, God is with us, guiding, teaching, and leading us to greater things.